We are here in Al Kuz and the missus is craving for good bread. Good bread. I can smell it. <laughs> Such a cool vibe. Hey. Hello. Hello, Chef JP. Hi, come on. Astig ng puesto nyo. Super cool. Yay! Really good bread over there. All right. Hey. Plain croissant, the hot dog, has last of the cinnamon. We have also the tangerine cheesecake donut, and also the amalfi lemon twirl. And also last of the mega cinnamon brown sugar toffee bun. Okay. And we have. Pwede pa ba magbrunch? Yes, po. We still have the for the lunch shift. We still have the roast beef sandwich. Mm -hmm. And also we have. Ah, uh, walapu sa menu namin yung turkey cranberry with brie sandwich. Mm -hmm. Using the shabata bread. Pwede niya mag-order ng extra bread. Ah, extra egg. Anong, anong bagay? Poach? Smoked salmon po? Oo. Hindi, poach. Poach na lang. Oh. Walang poach. Sige, scramble eggs. May tanong oh. ako. Yung Caesar sauce niya sa roast beef sandwich. If I had a restaurant or if I had another concept, gusto ko siya parang ganito. Gusto ko parang hole in the wall lang, sa garahe lang, you know, like real, authentic, and the vibe. And I'm sure you can I, you can feel already na masarap dito. Kasi, basta, di ba? I mean, versus sobrang ayo, maayo, sobrang ayos, sobrang perfect. And then, nag-focus sila sa ganyang aspeto and nakalimutan na nila yung mismo yung dahilan bakit nilang ginawa. And dito parang na feel ko. Well, I've heard so many good things about this place already. Tagal na to. This has been here for a while. It's just that it's just that now, you know, we finally came over. Pero yan. Anyway, dagdag lang. Um Ala, minsan kasi the most unassuming things or yung pinakasimpleng bagay, yun pa yung grabe yung impact. Di ba minsan yung mga, especially sa mga mayaman, yung mga totoong yaman, hindi sila kailangan magbihis, hindi sila kailangan mag, magyabang or hindi sila kailangan nagpakita na mayaman sila. Pero alam mo lang kasi sa aura nila. So same rin here, parang wala lang, doon ko lang na-connect. Na <laughs> same rin here, parang hindi nila kailangan mag-flex para sabihin sa atin na masarap dito. Hindi ko pa nga natikman, no? pero alam ko na na masarap eh. Well, itsura pa lang kasi. Our food is here. What did you get? Um, What? The roast beef sandal. Ooh, this looks huge. <laughs> Ang laki. Dito na pa siya. Mm -hmm. Oh. Mm. Mm. Is it good? Mm -hmm. It's a cold sandwich, which I like. This roast beef is actually very, very good. Good caramelized onions, of course, good bread, good beef. Overall, good. It's real. It's unapologetic it's unpretentious i love that word unapologetic yeah it's authentic it's not aside it's masarap kinai ko na kanina mm. mm. and it's so meaty no like heavy really really good bread the bread is outstanding mm -hmm. And you know what? It's been really hard to find good bread here in Dubai. Correct. Mm. Mm, 
is so good. Mm, everything about the sandwich is good. Again, the bread, the meat, all the condiments, even the packaging. Mm. The company? Of course, of course, na man. Yun yung pinaka importante. And the service also, they're so warm and just straight up. Look, look, look. The salmon. Ooh. Ang laki, no? Ang laki ng serving nyo. Oo nga. Nagulat ako, actually. I really want to buy this bread, okay? Mm. Stay cold. Mm. The dill, capers, onions, the salmon, the bread, cream cheese. Hit the spot. Birch. Magiging suke kami dito. Okay, kaya tayo. Di ba yung. Sorry, kanina. Wipe out. So, so good. This beef, roast beef sandwich reminds me of when I was a young apprentice in Australia and for like a year, all I was doing was making sandwich. And we made a similar sandwich. Not as good as this one. The bread is way better. <laughs> but our, so basically... Which is I, better? Which bread is better? This, here. Um, so yeah, as a young apprentice, I, we, I worked at a sandwich place and we did everything from scratch, except for the bread. So we made our own roast beef, on, uh, caramelized onions, all the condiments we made. Um, so this is like flashback from how I started in the kitchen in Australia. And I remember earlier yung analogy ko na yung sa mayaman or yung may K, yung totoong may K, hindi kailangan magyabang. Yun yung palagi nire-remind ni Camille sa akin na chill ka lang, simple, simple. I mean, you know, simple lang, chill. Hindi kailangan mag hindi kailangan maging maingay kasi lalabas naman talaga yung totoo eh, kung anong meron, di ba? And that's why I was saying earlier na kahit hindi ko pa siya natikman, alam ko na na may ibuga to. And true enough, this place is amazing. I will be back and back. Ano yan? I will be back, back, back. Ano yan? How do you say it? I will be back and back and back and back. Basically, magiging suki ako. Alright? Yeah. I, I love how simple the place is, pero... You can feel the heart and the soul, you know. And I, I, I asked them, so because you guys have any other bread? So usually they open at, um, they open kasi at seven, so they sell out by morning palang. Mm. So that's why there's not a lot left right now. So I think we have to come early in the morning. And as restaurant owners or as chefs, this it's places like this that reminds you of how you started or why you want to give good food it's establishments like this i mean siguro if like our if your followers hadn't noticed yet but we don't really like going to mga restaurants that are so you know all glitz and glam but nothing to offer you know what i mean fluff lang yun yun. all fluff all gimmick. No gimmick. No to gimmick places. Basta yung the real deal. But may, um, mahal man o mura, basta the real deal. Yeah. Uh, pupuntahan ko kahit saan at babayaran ko kahit magkano o kahit ano. Basta authentic. And straight up good food, you know, honest service. Yeah. Okay, balikan tayo sa ating restaurant. Inspired na tayo. Minsan kasi you just need a good meal to get inspired. And thank you, Birch, for inspiring us. <laughs>